Alright, so we're back playing some more SCP roleplay. And oh my god, guys, it's finally here. The roleplay update. That is right, guys. SCP roleplay just got one of their biggest updates yet. And we are here to play on its first day. I don't even know where to begin. There's so much to do. I don't even think I can cover everything in this video. Like, should I play as Class D? Should I play as this, like, admin department? Should I play as Chaos Insurgency? I don't even know. Let me just see that order. Class D, admin department, then I'm not hopping as Chaos Insurgency at the end. So, you know what? Enough talking. Let me just spawn as the Class D right now. And oh my god, guys, look at this thing. Look at it. The new facility, the new Class D containment. And guys, the new Class D containment looking pretty cool, pretty good. I'm gonna check that area out in a bit. Looks like, looks like a soccer ball, okay? Here's obviously the cafeteria. Looking pretty nice. Can you grab any food? Like, can you uh, grab any of these things? Can you eat it or drink it? I don't think you can. Right now, let's go outside here. Let's see what this area is all about. Looks like it's just a soccer field or something. I think that's my boy Jerry here. What's up, sir? Yeah, let me access your shop. So, same old, same old shop here. Very standard, very good. All of these prices do look the same. Nice. Honestly, I think I'm just gonna join uh, at an apartment, like, right off the bat. Just because I just want to check out this classic attainment really uh, shortly. Also, what is this button up here? It looks like a sun. The first time I saw it, I thought it was some sort of brightness or something like that. I don't know. But yeah, now you have stats, achievements, so you have these kill effects, uh, the C4 effect, okay? As I was saying, let me just hop in as this uh, admin department here. So yeah, let me click on this tablet, uh, like so. We've seen this in a trailer, but like, looks like it got updated a little bit. Alright, so site status. Um, riots, raid, breach. It's a slight risk right now. Currently six hostiles, okay. Site policy, this is what I'm interested about. Sector 3 motion sensors, so then you can detect SCPs. There's also some other ones over here, like a Tesla gate, I was looking at that. Limited battery scrambler goggles and some other electric circuit stuff, okay. Let's see our task real quick. Looks like a site cleanliness, looks like it's a slightly unclean. SCP-002. And then janitor votes, looks like you need to get voted on to become a janitor or something like that. Cameras, of course, are just like the cameras. Let's just check this Class D cell. Let's do middle camera. And yeah, you can see this whole entire Class D containment. Let me exit. Let me click cameras again. And let me view some SCPs. Let's view someone like, I don't know, 049. Oh yeah, and here's him in his new containment. Looks like, uh, I, I, don't, I don't know where he is right now. And then there's SCP radar, which I guess you can like see where all these SCPs are at. And then power off, which uh, just closes this thing. Alrighty. Yeah, you know what? Let me just explore the site as like an admin apartment. Looks like these guys have their own dedicated cafeteria as well for some RP purposes. So this is obviously a sector, uh, I don't know what is this, sector 1 or something. Let's go sector 2. I think sector 2 is the main area. And yes, this was sector 1. We just came from sector 1. Looks like the interrogation room is now here, which is really good. I remember uh, shooting someone here. There's the IA spawn here, internal security department. Here's the medical sector. I'm going to check that out a little bit later. Let me just keep checking out the site. So obviously here is where the classic containment is. And, and I just got eliminated, okay? Yeah, I think I'm just bad at PvPing in this game. Let's go this way now. I'm not gonna go there. Let me go this way this time. And here's a Transformer room. Let me actually see this area real quick. Looks like there's some Transformers here. You might need to destroy this one. This Wait, what, what was that? This thing just randomly spawned. Did you guys see that? Okay, that is whatever. Obviously, here's the Chaos Insurgency spawn thingy, or like the vent at least. You gotta destroy that wall. Very nice. I really like this new Transformer room. And I'm guessing this is where the control room is now. Nice. And look at this, there's two entrances, or two exits. And that is really good, so you don't have to camp one door, you have to be careful about both of these doors. Looks like these SCPs are not breached shell at the moment. Let me actually try to see myself in this camera, look at this. We guess we go to like other, and then we go to, yeah, control room. Oh my god guys, look at me, there I am. There's also bathrooms here as well. I'm guessing you can actually like, go through events here or something. Like maybe you have to break a wall somewhere there. And here's this main area, I don't know what this area is called. And here's my boy Alex, what is up, sir? Same old, same old shop, hopefully Alex is doing pretty good as well. And here's the care department spawn, they literally spawn right here. That was actually pretty interesting that their spawn is right here before it was like, down that hallway there. Let me go out and see what's this building area for a bit. And wait a minute, you can actually go from all the way up here, what? Oh, so you can have these classies jumping down from here and then doing some stuff. That guy has a bulletproof vest, so I should be careful. Oh, that's a chaos uncertainty! That guy's a Glock! I can juke him out though. He can also juke me out! Yeah, I think I just have to get better aim. Goran goes this menu here, upgrade in 05 so I can minigun abuse. So yeah, let's spawn as this guy. Let's see if we have our uh, request A1. Yes, we do. We're not gonna click on that though, because we don't really need A1s at the moment. 
And yeah, let's just explore the area. Let's go back here. Let's actually go Sector 3. Yeah, let me just go outside here. I'm gonna make my way to Sector 3. This is where I actually want to be. Looks like 049 is... Oh. Bro, I didn't even see that Tesla gate there. Wow. Well, that's one way to see if the Tesla gate's working. I didn't even know there was a Tesla gate there. I think I'm just blind. These SCPs are currently contained. I'm gonna check that guy a little bit later. Oh god, guys, I do not have scrambler goggles on. I should be careful. Oh yeah, so this is 966. I'm not gonna go through here. I'm gonna go through this viewing room. And uh, let me just peek out here. If I click this button... Oh, that thing opens up. 966 is actually right there. He's not even in his containment. And yeah, whoever comes in his chamber entry is instantly going to see his face. Yeah, let me view uh, 023 a little bit. I'm pretty sure his uh, thing is a little bit different. There we go. Yeah, it looks like 023 is just in there. Also, I just heard some beeping. Oh, that vent just opened. Is there people in there? Yeah, there was a guy there. Looks like my teammate got that other chaos insurgency. Oh, and here is 002, the SCP that I've been wondering about. This is what the SCP looks like so far. You probably enter from there. I'm gonna check that guy out in probably another video, another time. Just roam the area for now. Ah, and here's 457. Look at him. Yeah, a high 457. This guy just says uh, dot dot dot. Let me ask him, what do you want? Wants to grow. I actually like how you can interact with this 457. There's probably a lot of other dialogue things you can do. Dialogue options. But that's something we just had to discover. Also, I heard this thing be broken again. I think that's enough exploring this facility. Let's actually go to some, uh, let's actually do some stuff. Yeah, I think that's enough exploring a site and exploring everything. Let's just join some good old chaos insurgency. So let me just spawn in. Let me actually go to this logger here. Look at all these things. Let me just have beacon on just because I like beacon. Let me just close this thing here because I already know my task. The teams look like there's a lot of foundation members, a lot of MTS you have to worry about. So here's a Sector 3 event that we saw earlier. I don't think I really want to go there. Let me just go to a different area. Also, look at this cave, guys. Look at this Chaos Insurgency cave. It actually looks so cool how, like, your base is literally in the cave. Yeah, let's go to this area here. It looks like there's two ways to go to. This way is outside Sector Med Bay. Bathroom Transformers Control Room. But first, let's just go give Med Bay a visit. I'm pretty sure I did say I will visit uh, Med Bay as an O5 admin apartment, something like that. But then, like, I left that other server, so, like, we are here now. Yeah, outside sector. Can you actually go from here or, like, something? I don't think you can. You have to break some sort of wall. I guess you do. Um, th there's a there's a floor here. I think that's just a missing texture or something. It's probably just some sort of glitch, guys. And you updates always have this thing. Don't worry, I'll get patched up. Yeah, let me click this thing here, and, uh, let me just hop down. I think you have to navigate this way to get out the area. There's a patient ward there. Ah, here, this looks familiar now. Yeah, here's this uh, NPC that we saw in the trailer, saw in the videos. Let's go outside here. We gotta be careful. That's my boy Alex there. Here's this uh, O5 or like admin apartment spawn. There is a transformer room here. I think we can do some sort of like hack. We're not a hack. C4 plant. There we go. And guys, this C4 plant takes a pretty long time. I'm pretty sure the same exact time as usual. If that door opens, I'm gonna run. Never mind. I'm not gonna run. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna get away. So yeah, I am running. Should I instantly go to control room hack? Nah, I'm just gonna go sector 3 first. Yeah, let's just go here. Watch out for this thing, of course. There we go. I think I'm just gonna go to the 008 guy and set up this hack. Then I'm gonna go to 079, do something like that. Ah, here we go. You can set this guy up like so. Pretty fast setup. People are gonna be notified of this, of course, with the beeping noise. Yeah, let me just peek out here, see if there's anyone. Looks like there's no one. I highly doubt anyone's gonna fix this thing just cuz. Ooh, I think Beacon kind of saved me there a little bit. There's also a guy coming. There's a Beacon brother down there. I hear the beeping. 008's going to be hacked very, very soon. Wait, how do I get out of here? How do I open this door? Oh, there's a guy here. Oh, that's Chaos Insurgency. Yeah, I think I kind of failed that, but I was okay. Let me just go back. Let me actually just go right over here. Sector 3. Yes, yeah, so let's go through here. Let's uh, destroy this vent. Oh look, I infected everyone, cool! Yeah, so I'm um, watch out for that. Let's get this guy here, we don't want to get infected, we gotta wait for this thing, goddamn! Oh my god, teammate, watch out! Oh my god, I infected my teammate. A few moments later. Let me not actually go Sector 3, I'm pretty sure people know that I'm gonna be there. Alright, so control room, bathrooms, uh, transformers. But yeah, let's see how you enter bathrooms. You gotta explode a wall or something, or like, maybe break a vent. No, oh, you do have to destroy a wall. Or explode it, I mean. Oh, wow, and you actually come from here. From bathrooms, let's go control rooms to this area. So, 079 hack. Awaiting connection. There's a guy here. 
That guy kind of scared me, I'm not going to lie. Let me just hack this uh, device. Pretty sure this is the same old hack. It just shows a 096's face on like the, the TVs. There we go. I don't know if I should wait in here or like go outside or something. Like scale out the place. I probably should, like this. Oh, I should get in. Oh my god. This control room's taking so long, they're gonna come back in no time. Oh my god, this is kinda bad. This is kinda scary, there's a guy here! God damn! Yeah, instead of doing control room hack, let me just go straight to 079. Anybody here? I don't think so, yeah. Let me go here. Let me just hack this device, let me set this thing up. It doesn't take that long to set up, probably like 10 seconds, something like that. There we go. Should I go to this area here, or something like that? Should I corner camp? Do you have any teammates with me? I think I do. Yeah, I have two people. This thing actually gets hacked pretty fast. You guys see that? And 079 has control of the site. Ooh! I think that's what 079 actually does. Look, the lights are going off and everything as well. That was actually pretty good. I'm pretty sure nobody was hacking 008, so that was all 09. I'm pretty sure 079 did all of that. Nobody was hacking a 008. Also, I hear a 066 somewhere here. He's loud. Yeah, 066 is somewhere out here. You know what? I think I'm just done here. Let me join class D again, and then let me just end it from there. Guys, I think I'm done checking out this update. I didn't go through every change in here. All I did was mostly look at the site, view the SCPs, view these events, especially the 079 events. Also, I keep hearing 066 for no reason. Overall, I feel like this update has been amazing so far. I will be checking this game out a lot more in the future. Definitely didn't cover everything in this video. But don't worry, I'll make a lot of content on this, guys. Don't worry about it. Alrighty, so yeah, guys. That was me checking out this biggest SCP roleplay update. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys like, sub, comment. It really helped me out a lot. And yeah, I'll see you guys next video.